my act on Monday began demolishing homes in a large slum in operation against substandard housing and illegal migration. Uh, our guest uh, this afternoon, Andy Vermont, who is a human rights journalist. Andy, good day and welcome. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you for joining us. Uh, Mayotte is a island in the Indian Ocean, which is controlled by France. Perhaps you could begin by giving us some context to uh, you know, this particular development with Fr the French forces that began demolishing the homes of hundreds of people, which is in a shanty town. Yes, uh, the reason behind the deployment of uh, police officers uh, and the authorities in Mayotte for demolishing homes is to address issues related to substandard housing and illegal migration. Mayotte, as you said, is an overseas department of France and is located in the Indian Ocean. This um, uh, island has been facing challenges with bad housing conditions and a high number of undocumented migrants, sans papier in French. Yes. What is the context to this case? You know, what were the procedures that were taken to reach this particular point? Uh, before the authorities began demolishing the homes, certain procedures had to take place. The specific details of these procedures was assessing the legality and condition of the structures, notifying the residents or owners and provide them with an opportunity to address any legal or safety concerns. It's important to note that the exact procedures followed in this particular operation were detailed in local regulations and laws of Mayotte. Yes, so these illegal immigrants, you know, where are they from? Mm. Um, um. This, uh, uh, most of these people, oh, I, I will talk about the tensions now, the tensions have been reported between the authorities and now the migrants uh, in Mayotte and the operation to demolish homes and address illegal migration uh, had triggered a lot of confrontations between security forces and some youths in the region. It has fueled also political tensions with the neighboring commerce as many undocumented migrants in Mayotte come from the Comoros. Mm. So when is the operation due to last? Uh, the operation known as Operation Wuambushu, take back in the local language, is reported to last for one week. The demolition of the Talus Tuslem, which is part of the operation, was originally scheduled for April 25, but this was suspended due to a court decisions. However, subsequent legal rulings authorized the French state to proceed with the demolition right now. Yes, uh, associations have denounced uh, you know, this as brutal measures violating the rights of migrants, but local elected officials and many residents have supported that. Supported it. Please enlighten us more on that. Yes, regarding the views on Operation Wambushu, associations have denounced it as a very brutal measure that they believe violates the rights of migrants and their fundamental rights. They argue that it is not a human solution to these complex issues of substandard housing and migration. However, local elected officials and many residents have supported this operation, likely due to concerns about living conditions, security, and the impact of the undocumented migration on the region. Thank you for having me. I appreciate you well, Mr. Andy. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.